DHL Supply Chain are committed to bringing in and developing talent across all areas of the organisation, with the roles and opportunities being as diverse as the people who perform them. I joined DHL back in 2016 as part of the graduate scheme, uh, so it's been six years in total and I've enjoyed every second of it. So I started off on the agency and then I wanted to progress my career and DHL were brilliant, saw something in me and progressed me through the channels. I was just doing odd jobs to keep me going for the next five years sort of thing and then I thought, oh no, I'll, I'll get a regular job again and um, yeah. I've been here three and a half years. As well. No regrets? No, no, I'm quite happy. The scale of DHL means the company is able to invest in the kind of technology that supports its workforce. People are at the core of our business, so we, we have to um, train our colleagues, we have to invest in them in order to, to help them provide the best service for our customers. Um, and we have to provide technology solutions that work alongside our colleagues. You know, it's, it's no point in thinking we can automate everything. You know, we absolutely will always need um, a very large number of colleagues to, to deliver our service. And they need to be able to work alongside technology and we need to invest in our colleagues to be able to do that. Never saw in other places like, uh, like using uh, like bots or, you know, for, for work. So it's like, it's, yeah, it's fun. It's very intuitive, you know, it, it helps you. You know, it makes, you get less mistakes. One of the most recent ones we've, we've started to, to use are wrapping robots. So what these are is exactly what it says, wrapping robots, um, really, really useful. So not only do they take away the manual handling element from the task, um, they actually, you can set the parameters on there. So you can wrap to a really, really high level, which avoids the operative stretching. They're quite quick as well. It allows the operative then to move on to a different task while that's whirring away in the background. It's been revolutionary in regards to how we pick and uh, I mean culture wise it's been received very well um, yeah it's been it's been fantastic to see how, how it progresses over time. DHL's inclusive approach to introducing the concept of robotics explaining how they would help colleagues manage their work was part of the key to its success. We've got to do things to increase our productivity and that's a fundamental part of what we explain to our colleagues that there'll always be a role for them and we're helping them to be more productive by adding robotics or other systems, um, just, just whether it's simple automation, just helping them to do their job in a more productive way, or through to, uh, to robotic systems that take away some of the more mundane tasks and allows them to focus on more value-adding activities. So it's about explaining that to colleagues and making sure that we, we are clear with them on the reasons for doing it, and that makes any change more successful. The biggest investment is to make sure that we, we as a business are more successful so that there are greater opportunities for them going forwards. Innovation at DHL isn't just about robotics. Everyone is encouraged to contribute ideas and think differently, whether it's technology, a service or process change. All voices are heard. I definitely would recommend uh, family or friends to come and work for DHL. I think it's a great place to work. They offer loads of training opportunities. Uh, you have regular one-to-ones, you have PDPs, personal development plans, and you have career plans in place, and they support you through that, but obviously 80% of it is driven through yourself, but they support you 100% through your journey.